Former Washington State Cougar Charles Dillon might have thought his career came to a close with an injury with the Indianapolis Colts last year in training camp. But as Keith Oso tells us tonight, that's when the Spokane shock came a-calling. From the Washington State Cougars to the Indianapolis Colts to the Spokane shock, it's been a wild two years for Charles Dillon. Well, we chased Charles for a long time. It wasn't until the first day of practice we were actually able to actually sign him. I was happy to, you know, come back here. You know, I know people here, and I knew, you know, I got friends back in Washington State, so I kind of knew a lot of guys, so I was happy. Once Dillon came into camp, he wasted no time turning heads. You know, he catches everything and, uh, and runs great routes. He's extremely coachable, uh, a good team, team player. Uh, but I realized right away he's a smart kid. I'm really having a lot of fun knowing that, you know, you, everybody's going to score touchdowns. You, you know, arena, you know, arena football, you got like, you know, well, Raul had five touchdowns last week. Andy had four. So it's kind of crazy how you never know what can happen. And in a real game, you know, in a real outside game, ain't no way you go score five touchdowns. Dylan is having fun because the game is fast paced. He's also having fun because he's not cold. You don't understand. I, when it comes to cold weather, I'm probably the worst guy that don't like playing in cold weather or rainy weather. So the inside thing is real great. Dylan hopes that with a good season inside with the shock, he'll be headed back outdoors in the NFL next year. In Spokane Valley, I'm Keith Oso, KXLY4 HD Sports.